Hey, attention crypto gossipators, things are about to get interesting. Remember, not financial advice. Hey guys, what is up? Hope everyone is doing well. Hope everyone's having an amazing day because I am as usual. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. So we've got a massive, massive headline here, a post on Reddit, a forum that I really, really like because we got a lot of raw opinions, raw thoughts, ideas, everything. So this one goes with the question, anyone have any idea what's going on around bone? No volume, no pump. Now, guys, um, it is true that bone has been floating around, you know, the $1 mark, maybe a little bit more. Um, so let's just see what the people have to say about it. This it's just the chart doing its thing. We may never see one dollar again from June going. I'm not really worried about the price. I just hope the team won't do any shady uh, stuff in the days ahead. There's just no demand for it and won't be until Shibarium. I'm getting ready to buy more, but now I've really stalled. Shadow Cat dude might be mentally ill. I don't want to waste more money if that's the case. And his illness isn't actually valuable. It's got a lot. He's caused a lot more uncertainty with this than anything. 100% agree. Who's Shadow Cat? Uh, so embarrassing. I sold a billion when that came out. Shaitoshi, I disagree. He's bringing in real talent, making Shib a well-known name outside of crypto. This is something those fruitcakes that still run the original Discord hated because it meant they lose control of their piggy bank. Proof, he's like Trump. We have the very best. Who are they? They are the best. Markets being markets, one side pumps, the others does not. Bear markets, tons of FOMO for Shibarium, then even more fud once people realize how broken the beta is this happens often in crypto people who barely follow projects just want a quick 10 times dive in at 1.70 thinking the beta will drive the price up but it's a beta it's literally here to be broken and fixed until it's perfect so the real l2 main net doesn't suck like the beta so when we trend to 160 all those fomos start to fud out at a loss because they don't understand this is a long hold not a short pump before you know if we're smacking off support just above 1.05 we also could very well trend back to 70 ish to find the bottom remember kids is still a bear market bone it needs to find its floor before it can find a ceiling either away more time is good hold is good patience is good Shibarium is in beta with no catalyst to pump it. Shadow cats are still holding, waiting for better profits before dumping on us again. It'll be a while until we get uh, we can get rid of them completely and the community's volume is high enough to catapult us past $2. Once on mainnet, everyone will see the value and the market will jump in. So a lot of interesting thoughts, ideas here. Guys, let's be honest. We did go through a fudding period, okay? That genuinely did drop the price down then we had all this uh, stuff with the silicon valley bank the financial markets that could have had an effect bitcoin also you know was going down but then it did go up although uh so bone just didn't follow but the point here is that we are all in pre shibarium okay so this is what i call this error this is the time to test to fix to identify issues and you know people out there actually see beta as the real thing which is really really crazy because the whole point of what is happening right now is to fix to identify problems why do they care so much about anything else that is happening it just doesn't make any sense ladies and gentlemen wake up and realize a very very important factor we right now ladies and gentlemen are uh, in a period of finding you know the most suitable and uh, best ways to keep shibarium operating okay and in its optimum that's what developers want that's why they're trying to you know dig deep uh, into any little hole so they can fix it okay before the real thing comes out and for us Okay, we're not developers and we're not working on Shibarium, but it creates an opportunity to load up. Simple as that. So I don't know why why people want a pump. What is the point of a pump? Okay, it pumps to $2. What happens now? What Are you happy? Are you planning to sell? We're still pre-Shibarium. 
So what is the point? Even if we pump to $5, are you still going to sell? You don't want to wait until Shibarium comes out? So really be intelligent about certain things and uh, ignore the, the rubbish thoughts. Don't think, you know, in a very plain, direct way. You know, think a little bit deeper and understand what is going on. And from then on, ladies and gentlemen, you will start making a lot of money because a lot of people are just kind of very, very short term thinkers. They're like, oh, the price has gone down. It's staying the same way. Oh, OK, so it's the end of it. I guess it's game over. It's the end of the world. Time to pack up and run away and look for the other thing that could make us overnight millionaires. Guys, that's not how things work. OK, You're gonna have to be a little bit more intelligent about things. We're going to have to be clever about things and stop enough, enough with uh, all this, you know, falling for all this crap, this FUD. Write down in your calendars, okay? Um, I don't know, for example, summer. I, I'm going to check, next time I check is summer. Um, right now, anything that happens uh, before summer, uh, don't even dare panic. Okay, if Shibarian comes out before summer, great. But if not, then you're going to have to make a few notes, okay, take out your notebook, whatever it is, on your phone reminders, and just write down, um, dear uh, myself, okay, I will be calm, and I am in the pre-Shibarium uh, era, and if there are any more issues, then that is even for the better, because that means that things are getting fixed. Uh, things are becoming, you know, better. They're upgrading, improving, rather than, you know, creating rubbish. So as of now, guys, what can I say? Things are very, very interesting also. So make sure that you engage, you talk, you let me know what you're thinking. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that notifications bell. Guys, thank you so much. Appreciate all the support. And I'll see you in my next video. Peace out.